Dinosaurs died out over 65 million years ago. That's why when we do find them, they're usually just fossilized bones. Paleontologists say the chances of finding a preserved mummy dinosaur is kind of like winning the lottery. Well, it looks like they won because that's exactly what they found. I'm Danny Burke. Let's talk about a dinosaur mummy. I think all that's missing is the word vampire, and that could be the next biggest movie of all time. The dinosaur was found in the oil sands of northern Alberta, Canada in 2011, but the reports have only recently been published. It died over 110 million years ago, and its body ended up at the bottom of an ancient sea. The minerals there were perfect when it came to preserving it, and it gradually fossilized the entire body. Now, scientists say that they found its skin and even the contents of its guts were totally intact, with the director of the whole project calling the whole thing exceptional. Now, this area is known as a bit of a fossil hotspot. At least two or three specimens are uncovered there every single year. Some of that is due to natural erosion, but this specimen, an Ankylosaurus, and many others were uncovered accidentally by mining. The operator at the mining facility saw a block with a strange pattern. He called a geologist, and the team went and collected it. Since then, they've been preparing the fossil, which has now finally gone on display at the Royal Tyrrell Museum in Alberta. It's also been photographed for the front cover of June's National Geographic. Living and dying as a dinosaur, being incredibly preserved in an ancient sea, and then 110 million years later, making the cover of a magazine. It's a very strange life. I'm Danny Burke. We've got stories just like this all day, every day, so make sure you subscribe to Information Overload if you haven't done so already, and I'll see you in the next video.